In this half-life problem, I have 5 grams of a radioactive sample with a half-life of 10 years. If the sample is 60 years old and I want to figure out how much I originally had, the first step I need to do is figure out how many half-lifes have passed. So, if one half-life is 10 years and 60 years have passed, that means that 6 half-lives have gone by. If right now I currently have 5 grams of the substance remaining, in order to figure out how much I originally had, all I have to do is go backwards in this case. So, one half-life ago, I had 10 grams. Two half-lives ago, I had 20 grams. Three half-lives ago, I had 40 grams. Four half-lives ago, I had 80. Five, I had 160. And six half-lives ago, I had 320 grams. So again, you all, in any half-life problem, the first step you need to do is figure out how many half-lives have passed. And in this case, I'm going backwards in time, so I'm figuring out how much I originally had. So I would have to double it after each half-life. In other problems, where you're going in the other direction and you're figuring out how much you will have left from a starting amount, you would figure out the number of half-lives, and then you would go in the direction of breaking it down by half for every half-life.